Hey everybody, this is Erica, the technology nerd who likes to film stuff, and I have a quick video right here for you all. This is the soft gold version of the OnePlus 3, so I quickly want to open up the box, show you the color of the phone and what it looks like in comparison to the graphite version. This is the one that first came out. I just finished giving this device away. Congratulations to Murad. Now, OnePlus saw that I was sad that I gave away Alejandro, so they decided to entrust me with this one, which I will call Alexandra or Lexi. So at least I'll have one to compare to future devices. I really love sharing stuff with you all, but it's true I wouldn't have had one to compare to other devices, so thank you OnePlus for that. So I don't want to just sit here and babble. Let's go ahead and get the box open. I've got my knife. Peel away this packaging. Now I understand this has a white front face and I'm not sure what I'm going to think about that because I really like how the black one looks. So, come on. Open. Hmm, not so easy to open. Is there tape? Am I missing something? No, I'm not, okay. So let's let gravity do its thing. Thwomp. There it goes. And so here we have the device and the soft gold backing. Let's go ahead and peel off all this stuff. I'm gonna peel off the screen protector as well, because I'm somebody who doesn't really like screen protectors. Okay, so I've got all those screen protectors and things off, and here we have it. Now when they say soft gold, this really is soft gold. I'm so used to seeing really gaudy, ugly looking types of gold devices, but this is actually really nice. It's just got a slight gold hue to it where this one just looks a little bit darker. That's not bad at all. I didn't know if I like this color, but this is actually quite nice. You can see that you've got this plastic inset. This helps get antenna reception. And on here, it's a bit of a kind of cream color. Then looking at the fronts, you can definitely see a stark difference in the white. This kind of makes it look more iPhone-ish. Really, I think if someone was walking around on the street at first glance, I might think that this was a six S plus or something. That is actually not bad. I didn't think I would like that white face, but it's actually quite pretty. Actually, let's grab the gold iPhone 6S plus. So gold, much more gold, a lot more yellow tint and a very soft gold. This is the gold for me, you guys. It's almost like an off silver with a very light gold hue to it. So side by side, you can really see the difference. But yeah, that this looks like an iPhone, doesn't it? Complete with our volume buttons, or rocker in this case on the OnePlus 3, and also switch. Uh -huh. Well, there you go. If you like the aesthetic somewhat of what Apple provides iPhone-wise, the OnePlus is prettier, must say. The bezels are less chunky, and I actually like the tint of the white a little bit better as well. I was worried that these capacitive bits where the LEDs are would really stand out, but they don't. So the white definitely does not look cheap. The chamfer looks really shiny and nice on here. You've got this nice gold accent around the home button and fingerprint sensor. I have to say my favorite still would be the graphite version, but this is a really nice looking phone. Let's go ahead and put some cases on it and see what it looks like. So here you have this rosewood one. You're going to cover up that really nice goldish color, but that doesn't look too bad with the white face. I'm starting up the phone at the same time as I'm doing this. This is the bamboo one. I think the bamboo looks pretty nice on this. The light color with the light color makes sense. Then we've got the Kevlar backing. And actually, that might be my favorite. That looks really nice, the Kevlar blacking with the white and the gold. Mm-hmm. Phew, that is hard to get off. All right, so now we've got this one that looks like a zoot suit. This is the dark black apricot, forget which they call that. And that looks nice too. I think these are all looking quite nice with this white face. And last but not least, we have the sandstone one. And this might very well possibly be the most protective one of all of them because it's got the most material. It also will protect the camera the best. And yeah, that looks pretty nice as well. So this just gives you an overall idea of this phone, the color, what it looks like, what it looks like with all the cases on. So this is all that I want to show right now, you guys. In the box, there is 
just everything that you would get with the normal OnePlus 3 version or the graphite one. You've got your DAS charger and also the cable. So that's it. So thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Erica, the technology nerd likes to film stuff. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Let me know which one that you like best. I'm always going to have a soft spot for black. That's just my thing. But this is actually pretty nice and growing on me very quickly. Let me know what you think. And see you guys later. Bye!